Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And um, one of the biggest flaws that was fixed this week is the one that is the easiest to exploit. Apparently, it's super easy to infiltrate a Windows PC with this security flaw that was fixed on Patch Tuesday. It impacts the um, TCP IP of IPv6. Now, what does that mean? So, when you go on the web, usually what happens is that you are connected with an IP address. And that IP address, which is kind of like your postal address, you know, tells the, uh, the world who you are. And um, one of the biggest problems that was happening is that IPv6 which is used also on some networks now because IPv4 um, was just um, too much, there was just too much uh, ad addresses used and there was no more space. So they um, decided to do an IPv6, which you know makes a lot more of these IP address available. Now, there's a flaw in Windows where a series of packets that are carefully crafted are sent to the computer or device will open up a flaw that lets attackers easily take control and do what they want. So this is the biggest flaw that was fixed this week, and apparently it's been there for a while also. Uh, there are some accounts of attacks dating back to the month of May of 2024. So this one is the easiest to exploit. And they were saying in a security bulletin that even if you change things in your router, even if you change um, you know, settings in the firewall, doesn't matter, still infects and still works. The only way that a unpatched machine can be safe is to turn off IPv6 completely in Windows. And then that has another impact because apparently some of the apps of Microsoft now rely on IPv6 to work well. And um, so, you know, it's a complex little issue here. So they are uh, mentioning that that security flaw is really bad and it's the easiest to exploit. All they have to do is a careful, carefully crafted series of packets going through the IPv6 and there you go your PC is vulnerable if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching